up Phil Doctor Germany my name is Ben welcome to the show and we start right away with this iPhone 7 plus here device was mailed in no boot no function at all no charging nothing and we will have a look how we can solve this problem in the fast way so I got a lot of other screws here on the table and other devices for fixing just do this fast so if you get one video today because we didn't have anything until now done for YouTube because we just got too much work in today's day uh, you know these days when you better go home because n only only fucking devices on my table with fucking errors but these days happen okay here we find two screws directly lay laying down in the device okay let's have a look what DC power supply tells us about this device here do we get a short or not what do we have here Okay, get it off and just need this one here, see what we got, we got no short, ah we got a short, we got a short at 1.5 amps when we boot, what this could be, Andy? Tell us what this could be. Could be short on. Yeah, or could be short on. Three we own and. I say three we own and or VDD boost, but my feeling says VDD boost. Okay. So let's get out the screen. Let's get out all the cables and it's really, I only repair today this device and this device and then I'm done. I don't want to repair any more anything today. I hope for a better day tomorrow. But tomorrow we won't fix much because we have a lot of work at the bottle and repair school next door. Because on Saturday we got, um, we got bottle and repair school and our room looks not good <laughs> we have to clean and um, yeah to vorbereiten to uh, I don't know in English we have to prepare sorry we have to prepare the room so there it is get out the board Get out the board. I have to go to the barber in about 30 minutes, 35 minutes, get my hair fresh cut and my my beard and don't know in English if it's right but yeah. So now let's have a look under the, um, under our thermal. What we got here? What do we have here? It's a nice short or not? Let us have a look. So, get it hooked up to DC power supply. Okay. Oh, we got a cap next beside to the NAND 3 we oh. <laughs> I said VDD boost and he said NAND. Here you see. Beautiful or not. We could burn this short out. Get some voltage. Get some amps in. No. We just pulled the cap. Replace. And we are back to life again. So, 
I will show it to you in the video. We'll see the cap, okay? So. Should be that cap. Okay, just check again if I'm right. I don't know exactly if I'm right, but I think so. Not my day, not my day. Just forgetting things within minutes. Okay, let's have a look again. Is it this side or at the other side? It's the other side. Okay, get off the underfill to see a little bit more if it's the cab in the middle or not. Middle or top. Show to you on the thermal now. So just scrape away the overfill and then we can see directly the shorted cap. Okay, it's the top one. You see it on the point. The top one. Okay, let's do that shit and get this repair done. Slightly get away the overfill. Have a look for the for the other caps sitting here. And get it out. Just wait. Get some more heat. Don't want to rip any pads and get some flux. Yeah, here we are. Okay. Get some flux there and Solder iron. Great. Now just a little bit of fresh solder on both pads. Great. And we are almost done. Just scrape away the overfill or underfill, like ever. How you would call it. Then get it clean. You see? Looks really clean. Get the new cap. And place it there where it has to be. At this point. And you see one cap. Fucks up the whole device.
Okay, done. You see? Looks great. Looks clean. Like ever. Now we can check again. Now we can check again and we have no more short and the device is booting. It's nice. So, just get the board in there. Just get the board in there. Get the home button and screen on it. Get a battery hooked up. And try to start the device. And we are back to life again. It's like magic. Only one cap. And whole device without any functions. All the data away. And customer needs help. So. That's what we do. Just a little bit of magic and we got the device running again, just waiting for the boot. And after that, you will see, yeah, we got home button feedback. So in some seconds we are there. Phone is back to life again. We got all the important data on the phone. Now I just clean one more time the board, clean the clue on the screen and things like that and then the device goes right away to the customer okay i'm out wish you a nice day we see us with the next video if we got 10,000 followers on instagram and i think it will be within the next two weeks um, i will do a complete bot swap video for a8 okay i'm out we see us in the next video goodbye yours then